Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Welcome to another reading. This is for Aquarius um, in love. Yeah. Okay. Overall energy, Ace of Pentacles in reverse. Yeah, there's a lack of a new start here. Okay. Five of Pentacles with the Seven of Wands in reverse here. Someone's feeling left out because one person gave up on a connection, okay? You stopped fighting for a connection, okay? You could have been, you know, like literally standing your ground. You could have been fighting for this connection for a very long time. But someone's given up here, okay? And someone's moving forward is what I'm getting here. Yeah. Someone's moving forward and giving up on this connection because this is someone who's just fed up tired, right? No longer being able to hold on to something. They're losing ground here. Yeah, they feel unsupported. Lack of new start here with Ace of Pentacles in reverse. Yeah, Ace of Pentacles in reverse is also where this is uh, someone who's doubting themselves. Okay, a lot of self-doubt and fear and is what can stop this growth. Okay, but this is also a missed opportunity, a missed golden opportunity here. We have the death here with the judgment in reverse here. So I feel that on your mind, there is an ending, okay, that you're resisting right now. Something needs to end. Something needs to be let go of. But instead of letting it go, instead of letting it end, it's being dealt with. Okay, and that's what's on your mind. So either there's someone here who's not letting you go or you're not letting someone go. And the foundation of the reading is that there is a lack of reconciliation. Okay, because someone does not want to give something a second chance here. Or someone does not want to repeat their past mistakes. We'll see that. Okay, but there is indecisiveness for sure. Someone's not being able to decide of what they want to do. And that's why they're not... Um, that's why... There is a lack of an ending here, okay? Something that's an inevitable ending, okay? But it's like, it's delayed rather than just letting it end and letting it go. In the past with the Empress here, there was a lot of growth, a lot of expansion here, okay? Something was growing, something was being very nurtured and cared for, okay? There was a lot of security and stability in a connection. In the near future here with the Three of Pentacles here, there is a partnership that's coming in, okay? With the Three of Pentacles here, it's also... Um, where someone wants to grow with you, someone wants to rebuild this connection with you or someone just wants to partner with you, okay? Wanting a partnership, this is let's let's talk, okay? And this is a lot of cooperation, a lot of compromise from this person here, okay? They want to build from scratch with you. How you see yourself here is the Knight of Swords in reverse, okay? So I feel that you are trying to avoid a confrontation, okay? Trying to avoid communication here. You're being a real coward right now. Again, Aquarius... These are the energies of the cards here, okay? Now, this could definitely be the person you're dealing with, okay? So, just take it how it resonates. I feel this is the person you're dealing with, okay, who's holding back communication here. Because in their emotions with the page of cups in reverse here, this is someone who wants to apologize, who needs to apologize, but they're holding back an apology, okay? Someone who's... The page of cups is, yes, it is someone who's very kiddish when they're in the reverse, that's being childish and kiddish to a whole new level here, okay? That's what they're doing. They're just not expressing themselves, okay? They're just not communicating, whereas they know they need to. With the Knight of Pentacles in reverse here in your environment, what you don't see coming is someone out here is fed up of investing into a connection where they feel strung along, okay? This is one person here who put in all the work, effort, but either there was one person here you were dealing with who was very slow to commit, or there was just a lack of forward movement here, and things are just stuck and stagnant. Now, this person's like, you know what? Screw it. Nothing's happening here. I'm moving forward here. This is a lot of feeling stagnant, stuck, okay? With the hermit as the outcome here, I look. it looks like uh, there's some kind of separation that's going to be maintained, okay? That no communication. If you're not in com no communication, if you're not in no communication, there will be no communication as the outcome here. But there is a separation that I see here, okay, as the outcome here. But someone wants to take some time off, okay? Someone wants to fly solo. They want to... Think a lot about the situation or the connection that they are in, okay? This is a lot of what, when, where, how, why. Someone's wondering if they are in the right connection or if they need to move on, okay? But a lot of contemplation, okay? Are they in the right relationship? Are they doing the right thing? Whatever happened, was it the right thing? Why did it go wrong? You know, etc. So a lot of thinking. Why is the Ace of Pentacles in reverse here as the overall energy? Why is the Ace of Pentacles in reverse? Say King of Swords in reverse. Yeah, because someone's not communicating. You're dealing with someone who's either who you cut someone off who was not who was very cold detached, or you're just dealing with someone who's not communicating properly with you. 
This is someone who's very, very manipulative. Okay, this person is really smart, very intelligent. But they use their intelligence, they use their power. Okay, they abuse their power. Okay, they misuse their intelligence and their logic to manipulate you. Is what I'm getting. But I think there's just no communication here. You're just dealing with someone who just, <clears throat> um, you know, is not the best at communication. Okay, but you cut someone off. What's the King of Swords in reverse? High Priestess in reverse, yeah. Because something was revealed. Something came out, okay. There was some truth that was revealed. Probably what was revealed is that this person, I don't know what was revealed, okay. But with the High Priestess in reverse, yeah, this is definitely something that came out to the open, okay. There was some information that was revealed which forced you to cut this person out. And that's why right now, and that's why it was a missed opportunity here. Things could have really, really grown, okay. It could have been a small seed which could have helped you to grow this relationship. It had a lot of potential here. But because someone was just not reciprocating or just being cold, that's why, that's just that you probably got to know about this person, the other side of this person here and you just had to cut them off. <clears throat> Why is the five of pentacles here? Eight of pentacles. You're moving forward and you're just building on your own. Okay, you're taking care of yourself. You're moving forward. You're let, you you no longer want to be in a relationship where you're either uh, feeling single, okay, or you're feeling isolated and neglected by someone. You don't want to do this, but you have to do it because you feel you need, feel the need to work on yourself, okay, with the eight of pentacles here. I think you're working on yourself. You know, you're investing all the time, energy on yourself, building, you know, your own uh, security, stability, whatever, right? What's the eight of pentacles here? Yeah, eight of cups in reverse here, but there is someone here who can't move on from you. Yeah, there is someone who wants to come back towards you whilst you move forward. That's what it is because with the two of cups here in, uh, at the bottom of the deck, there is a relationship here, okay, that someone wants with you. You that, Not in the relationship, I feel there's a connection that you feel with someone, okay. It could be, it could be that you're physically moving on, okay, or you're just trying to divert your mind and trying to put yourself into uh, work. You're just throwing yourself into work, but emotionally, you're still not being able to walk away or... I think there's someone here who's wanting to come back towards you, okay? Someone who walked away from you is wanting to come back towards you. Six of swords in reverse, okay? This just fell out. I'm not going to take it, but someone can't move on. Yeah, see, someone can't move on whilst you're focusing on you because it's like, I'm getting like the five of pentacles. It's more like a forced departure, okay? It's like I'm forced to move away and forced to work on myself, okay? And where you see, the moment you do that, the other person comes in, okay? Why is the seven of wands in reverse here? Nine of swords in reverse. Yeah, see, you, you, you want to sleep better, okay, babe? You just want to stop stressing about this. Because you have sleepless nights, okay? You want to see the light out there, don't tell it. You want to sleep better, okay? You want to get over this worry, stress, and feeling of, and this feeling of a lot of remorse, regret, pain about what happened, okay? You just want to get better. You don't want to stress over this connection, okay? Is why you, why you stop putting the effort and why you stop fighting for this. Things were not changing. Wheel of Fortune in reverse here. I thought there was something that took a turn for the worst. Okay, or things were just not changing. Something, someone was not listening, was not learning their karmic lessons because of which there was a cycle that was stopped, or you constantly repeated the negative pattern with this person. What's the death here in reverse here on your mind? Four of Swords in reverse. Yeah, someone's choosing to talk, okay? Someone refuses to end a situation, although it's driving them nuts. This is someone who's getting very, who's reaching that point of burnout, okay? They're exhausted, they're mentally exhausted, okay? But they're wanting to talk to you. This person is not refusing to let you go, okay? They want to talk to you. What's the Four of Swords in reverse? Two of Cups. <laughs> it just wanted to come. This person wants... A relationship with you for sure okay five of wands in reverse here they want a peaceful resolution they're done fighting with you okay they want to be on the same page with you now if this is not on your i mean this could definitely be the person you're dealing with okay and i feel this is the person you're dealing with okay because you're definitely choosing to work on you okay focus on yourself
just placing the cards so I can see them clearly. There's that glare that's coming in because of which I can't see things. Just one second. Can you guys see the cards? Okay, yeah, that's better. All right, tell me about the judgment in reverse here. This is the reason for the reading. This is the foundation. No second chance is given. Why is the judgment in reverse here? This is also being indecisive, right? Why is the judgment in reverse here? Six of Wands. Someone's not giving something a check second chance here. Aquarius, you're moving forward. You're moving forward here. What's the judgment in reverse and the Six of Wands here? See, Eight of Wands in reverse. Yeah. You're no longer interested. You're holding back communication, okay? You don't want to move forward anymore. So, yeah, see? You're moving forward. You're holding back, okay? You're purposely holding back communication or this is just stuck in stagnancy? I, I don't feel you want to move towards this person anymore here. You're moving forward. You're stopping this relationship. You're putting something to a halt here. I'm not going to take this, but five of wands here, okay? Because this person probably, you know, this is someone who has a lot of drama and chaos or this, there's a lot of competition and you don't want to fight competition anymore, okay? This person brings in a lot of drama and chaos in your life and you're like, you know what, I'm done. I don't want this anymore. That's this energy of you being determined. Like, you know, I don't want to be successful in this relationship anymore. I'd rather be victorious in any other aspects of my life. Say probably career, goals, you know, your financial goals, your money, anything else but this relationship. Whilst this person out here is wanting a relationship with you now. Yeah, they want to talk to you. What's the empress here in the past? What's the empress here? See, someone tried to avoid a commitment in the past year, okay? So, I'm getting that you given your 100% to this person here, okay? You were nurturing, caring, you given your full, you given your all to this person here, okay? That's why things were growing so fast. But ultimately, something crashed down and you realized, okay, that someone was just not committal. Someone was just commitment phobic, okay? What's the empress here? You were very focused on taking care of this person and this relationship here. Yeah, see, 10 of pentacles in reverse. That's what exactly I said, right? There was a lack of commitment here, lack of stability. A situation which you were committed to was just not being committed. It was just not reaching that point of commitment from this person's side. Whereas you gave in your 200% into this, okay? What's the three of pentacles in the near future? What's the three of pentacles in the near future? Sun in reverse here. Although there is partnership, okay, although this person wants to work with you, right? But you're having a very hard time focusing on this happiness that's coming towards you, okay? I think you are constantly focusing on the negative aspect of this relationship of why it didn't work out. I feel you're being very negative and um, you're, you're, you're just having a hard time looking at things uh, in a good way. What's the sun in reverse? I think you're, you're just not happy. What's the sun in reverse here? What's the sun in reverse here? See, fool in reverse. That's what I'm saying, yeah? Right? This person's put you through a lot. Okay, Aquarius, they put you through a lot. And now it's like, I don't want to take a risk anymore because I don't want to be an idiot. Okay, I was a fool in the past year. I gave you my all. I tried to build on this, okay? I, I wanted to see your future with you. You know? I was feeding this connection, nurturing this connection, you know? I was taking care of you. I was taking care of this uh, as much as I could. See, seven of wands in the reverse. You were trying to protect this relationship from probably other people. Or you were trying to protect this relationship. You had your guards up. You know, it was that strong need to, um, you know, you had your boundaries, okay, where nothing could be affecting. You were fighting probably people that were affecting this relationship, everything. But you were just done because this was too much stress for you. And now, even if this person is coming in in the near future to work things out with you, you just... You just still feel left in the dark here, okay? Or I just feel you're having a hard time being optimistic about it. Why? Because you don't want to take a risk, okay? You don't want to take this leap of faith. In fact, you're taking leaps of doubt here. What's the Knight of Swords in reverse? What's the Knight of Swords in reverse here? Five of Wands, see? Because there's too much drama, conflict. I got this twice. You're holding back because you want to avoid conflict and drama, okay? This person is nothing but chaotic, okay? There's a lot of tension. You guys are never on the same page, you know? 
and there's always like who's right who's wrong and too many people involved probably what's the five of wands here and you're like no i just don't want to you're trying to run away from this situation is what i'm getting rather than address it why is the five of wands here I'm not going to take this, but see, 10 of cups in reverse, 9 of pentacles and the temperance in reverse here. Definitely, you're not in alignment, okay? This person is not in alignment with you, okay? You're not. I think you're losing patience. You're lacking that self-control here, okay? You're trying to control the outcome out here. This is a relationship that once made you very, very happy. But this is something now that you don't want anymore because it doesn't make you happy anymore. I think you've lost interest, okay? You don't feel for this person as much as you feel for them. But as much as you felt for them before. And I think with the nine of pentacles here, you are like, you know what? I have no choice but to let go of the past and just focus on me. Your focus is now your financial independence. Your focus is your career, your goals, your money. But again, with the temperance in reverse here, this is um, lacking patience, right? You just don't have the time to waste. Something is just moving too slow. And you're like, you know what? This is very slow progress. You want things to move faster? What's the five of wands here? Six of Swords, yeah, see? You're just moving forward. You don't know where you're going, but you're just moving forward. You know, you're just wandering into the unknown. You're picking a different direction is what I'm getting. You're just wanting to move forward, okay? You want to get into calmer waters. It's like you don't want to do it, but you just have to. The Six of Swords is the energy of like a wanderer, right? Someone who just, wherever the wave takes them is what you're doing, okay? As long as you're getting into calmer waters. Why is the Knight of Pentacles in reverse here? Ace of Wands in reverse. See, this person is stuck and stagnant in your environment here. That's why this is a situation that's going nowhere. This is a situation which is like a very on and off, on and off connection here, okay? And this could be someone here, this on and off connection is because this person refuses to put in the effort. Seven of Pentacles. This person is waiting, okay? Waiting very patiently. But things are on hold. Why the Ace of Wands in reverse? Why is the Ace of Wands in reverse? The Moon in reverse. Something's been revealed here. Again, right? So, Aquarius, this could also be, this could be the cross watch and this could be you, okay? Because I'm getting here as someone here who is just not investing into a connection because it's very, very on and off. And now the truth has been revealed, okay? Someone sees things for what it is very clearly. Here is a person here, the other person that you're dealing with, or this is, this could be you, this could be the person you're dealing with. There's another person here who's trying to avoid a confrontation because they know that it's going to be very chaotic and there's going to be a lot of drama and chaos involved here. But however, this person is wanting to come towards you, okay? So take it how it resonates. I don't know. I was just called to say that. Uh, page of cups in reverse is in your hopes or fears, okay? What's the page of cups in reverse here? Someone's emotionally unavailable or just not being able to communicate. Why is the page of cups in reverse here? Yeah, ten of wands in reverse. Because someone's holding back communication because they want to rob the Lord. Someone's very overwhelmed here and now they want to like literally like lay off the situation. What's the ten of wands in reverse here? Wow. <clears throat> This person, in your hopes and fears, okay, with the tower here, this is a situation where I think there is a huge realization on your part here, okay, with the tower here. You have a huge realization, a huge epiphany, okay, uh, that um, something's changed completely, okay. You've changed your approach, you've changed your mindset is also what I'm getting here. And it's been very unexpectedly. This is a relationship you realize that was bringing you more stress and anxiety, it was more of a burden and responsibilities rather than emotional happiness. That's why we saw the Ten of Cups in reverse here. And that's why you're shutting off emotionally. Okay. You're just not ready to cooperate. You're not ready to talk to this person. You know, you're being very closed off to this person. Six of Pentacles in reverse at the bottom of the deck. This was a one-sided situation. Okay. You didn't get what you deserve. This person gave you the bare minimum. Okay, or you felt that they were taking advantage of you somewhere, somehow. But you definitely did more work than they did, okay? You definitely put in more work in this relationship than they did. And that's why now you have this huge, uh, again, change 
of approach okay and your approach is like a very sudden okay it's a it's a very aggressive approach that you get okay with the tower here but things are changing drastically your mind has changed drastically see the two of wands in reverse here someone's holding that and this could be probably you making a decision okay probably you're just making a decision to stay safe is what i'm getting okay because yes you can take a uh, you can choose to pro you have two decisions in front of you is what i'm getting okay left or right in in it or not okay but i feel instead of being in it and choosing to suffer you're rather choosing to move forward here because that is the safer decision is what i'm getting here okay that's why the two of wands in reverse but again there's a huge realization of some sort okay and you're laying down the burdens here and you feel by not communicating or shutting down emotionally it's going to be better for you okay what's the hermit here what is the hermit as the likely outcome two points in reverse that just wanted to come out yeah see someone's being indecisive here someone's choosing not to make a decision or just making uh, choosing in the choosing to make a decision that is in their comfort zone i don't know why i can't talk i don't know why I'm trying to talk as slow as possible, but so weird. Why is the two of wands in reverse here? Why is the two of wands in reverse? So someone's definitely not making a decision right now because they're very isolated. Okay, they need more time. Yeah, see, magician in reverse here. There's a lot of self doubt here. Someone's not being able to make a choice out here. Okay, not being able to choose a path here because with the magician in reverse here, this is someone who has a lot of doubt. This is self doubt syndrome. Okay, they know they have everything that they need to make things work out with you. Either this person is not being able to manifest you back correctly, or this is someone here who has more negative thoughts. Okay, that why something won't work out rather than why something will work out. The magician is someone who's very confident, right? He ma he makes magic happen, right? He makes shit happen. But right now, this person feels they can't make things happen. Okay, probably they feel they don't have control over you. Okay, and this person is still staying silent. Yeah. They're still staying silent out here. I think this person, this is the same person here. They want to move forward towards you, okay? But again, they're holding back communication because they want to avoid any kind of conflict or arguments with you because they know they're not going to win. It's going to be a tough fight. They know that you're not going to give in without uh, a tough fight. And that's what they're doing. That's why they're trying to avoid it. They're being a coward here. This person is choosing again not to pick a direction here. Okay, they'd rather just be in hermit mode than just rather stay in their shell and stay isolated and not do anything about it. But that's what I have for you, okay, Aquarius. I hope this read is any. I hope this reading resonates with you. Leave your comments below, and I will see you next time. Bye bye. Next time. Bye bye. Next time. Bye bye. Next time. Bye bye.